Let's talk about the accountability triangle between teachers, students, and parents. They're all synced when schools succeed. Here's a parent who gets it. Utica Elementary Middle School's Parent of the Year, Melba Burks, is why they are this week's cool school. When I walked in and everybody was clapping and I was trying to figure out what was going on, um, it was, I was, I was excited. PTO President Melva Burks goes above and beyond for Ranger Nation, but she was surprised to receive the Parent of the Year Award at Utica Elementary Middle School. We have a lot of parents in our community that exhibit those same characteristics. So this decision was very, very uh, difficult to make. With two daughters at the school, she's always there to show support to the faculty and staff. They get tired of seeing my face. Mama, do you always have to be here? Mama, do you always have to do this? But when um, a parent comes down to help in the school, it does something to their parent as well as their child. It makes you want to come back and do more, especially when you're accepted and the doors are open to do so. She's helping us train other parents with leadership skills. Uh, she's just all in for everything that we do. Uh, anytime, anytime I'm faced with a challenge, I can give her a call. She is able to come up and help us deliver. When funds fell short to take students who did well on the state testing to an NBA game, it was Burks who stepped up to find a solution and keep the promise. Her motto is happy teachers plus happy students equal positive results. Burke says being an involved parent is easy when you have a principal like Dr. Smith. Every year he's led the school, their rating has increased from a D to now a B. So when Dr. Smith came in, the scale started rising, you know, like, hey, he keeping the teachers happy. We help keep teachers happy. You know, we getting positive results. It's a well-oiled machine they have going on in Utica, and this parent is just one of the hard-working gears. Yeah, so congratulations to Melva Bergs. So remember, you can nominate your school for, to be the cool school of the week. Just send us an email telling us about a program, a teacher, or a student, even a parent, to coolschools at wjtv.com. Andrew.